Tip number 255 from the book, 501 Contractor Tips. Don't forget to use the book along with the videos as a companion guide. Read the book. You need a little more information uh, on the tips. Hopefully there's a video already made. If not, I'm planning on making one video for each tip in the book. Just going to need some time to do it. 255 is to read books about sales. This is a, a give me here. Um, read books about anything you need information on. And some of us don't learn good by reading. I don't blame you. Audio books, videos, that's why they're there. And that's why I'm making the videos along with the book. And sales books are all over the place. They are, uh, we have them on everything. How to sell real estate, how to sell widgets, gadgets, and uh, even some on contracting. So if you uh, need a little more help, you're not quite uh, comfortable with it, then get on it. Get on these books. And uh, I wrote in my book, try to read at least one book a month. Um, when I wrote the book, that was kind of, that felt good to me. But uh, realistically, read at your own pace. You know, you might get a book that's uh, 5,000 pages. You're not going to read this in a month. You know, you get a book that's 100 pages, you can mow through this in a week. Um, wouldn't be a bad idea if you get a book that uh, seems pretty helpful, even like the contractor tip book. You know, you, you, you get a book like this, then um, uh, read it, reread it. Read it a few times. Read certain sections of it, uh, certain chapters over and over again. And uh, often what this does to us is kind of gets us thinking. And there was an old saying, I've spent some time working on it myself. You can read a book, let's just say when you're 20 years old, go back and read it when you're 30 years old and get a lot more out of it. Go back and read it when you're 40, you might not get as much out of it. Go back and read it when you're 50 and you get a lot out of it. And a lot of people don't do this. They read the book once, they're done, they never go back to it. But I found it very helpful to read books over and over again, and I'm not waiting a decade to do this. Uh, I've listened to books over and over again. Um, one book, in, for example, I've listened to probably 50 times on an audio book. Just put it in when I'm driving somewhere and uh, listen to it, and I've gotten stuff out of that, that book, one particular book, over and over again. I'm listening to it over and over again, just info after info, because my mind, the state of mind I'm in, the information that I have, that I've learned. Um, as you gain more information, this stuff kind of becomes brighter. Hey, I get it now. I thought I understood it. Now I get it. And then you might even get it. And then uh, five or six years from now, get it again, even better kind of a thing. And I see this a lot. So don't hesitate to read books. This is a, this is a big step. Um, was really uh, in my life. And again, me writing this book is kind of making my contribution back to society, trying to get contractors to uh, live a better life without robbing their, you know, you don't have to rip people off and you don't have to be viewed that way by your clients. You know, you don't have to be the used car salesman, the lawyer. I mean, this contracting thing is brutal. And, uh, you know, you can get a good reputation working with the right people and really have a, have a, uh, a nice life, uh, especially for your family. And uh, even if you don't have a family, you just want to uh, delve into this thing on your own, go for it. So reading books, uh, best way, in my opinion, that's where the information is. The more you read, the more you will succeed.